Blessings, 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 beloved. I am Mama Pam, a.k.a. Pamela Dobson, and I do read, beloved, seven minutes every day so you do not have to read. Not sure what's going on with my throat, but nonetheless, we're going to read. Uh, today's read is for Monday, Monday, June the 26th, 2023. Seven-minute read, reading from the King James Version of the Word of God, and it reads... Uh-oh, hold on, hold on, hold on. That ain't we supposed to. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Monday, the 26th. That says Monday, the 27th. Either it's the 26th or the 27th. We're going to go with the 26th. Praise God. Judge me, O Lord, for I have walked in mine integrity. I trusted also in the Lord, therefore I shall not slide. Examine me, O Lord, and prove me. Try my reins and my heart, for thy loving kindness is before mine eyes, and I have walked in thy truth. I have not sat with vain persons, neither will I go in with dissimilars. I have hated the congregation of evildoers, and will not sit with the wicked. I will wash mine hands in the innocency, so will I compass thine altar, O Lord, that I may publish with the voice of thanksgiving and tell of all thy wondrous works. Lord, I have loved the habitation of thy house and the place where mine honor dwelleth. Gather not my soul with sinners, nor my life with bloody men, in whose hand is mischief and their right hand is full of bribes. But as for me, I will walk in mine integrity. Redeem me and be merciful unto me. My foot standeth in an even place. In the congregation will I bless the Lord. Psalms 27. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Who shall I fear? And the Lord is the strength of my life. Of whom shall I be afraid? When the wicked, even mine enemies and my foes, came upon me to eat up my flesh, they stumbled and fell. Though a host should encamp against me, my heart shall not fear. Though war should rise against me, in this will I be confident. One thing have I desired of the Lord, that will I seek after, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to become the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in his temple. For in the time of trouble, he shall hide me. In his pavilion, in the secret of his tabernacle, shall he hide me. He shall set me up upon a rock. And now shall my, mine head be lifted up above mine enemies round about me. Therefore will I offer in his tabernacle sacrifices of joy. I will sing, yea, I will sing praises unto the Lord. Hear, O Lord, when I cry with my voice. Have mercy also upon me, and answer me. When thou saidest, Seek ye my face, my heart said unto thee, Thy face, Lord, will I seek. Hide not thy face far from me. Put not thy servant away. Away in anger, thou hast been my help. Leave me not, neither forsake me, O God of my salvation. Now when my father and my mother forsake me, then the Lord will, will take me up. Teach me thy way, O Lord, and lead me in a plain path because of mine enemies. Deliver me not over into the will of mine enemies, for false witnesses are risen up against me, and such as breathe out cruelty. I have fainted unless I had believed to see the goodness of the Lord in the land of the living. Wait on the Lord and be of good courage, and he shall strengthen thine heart. Wait, I say, on the Lord. Psalms 28. Unto thee will I cry, O Lord, my rock. Be not silent to me. Least if thou be silent to me, I become like them that go down into the pit. Hear the voice of my supplications when I cry unto thee, when I lift up my hands toward the holy oracle. Draw me not away with the wicked and with the workers of iniquity, which speak peace to their neighbors, but mischief is in their hearts. Give them according 
to their deeds and according to the wickedness of their endeavors. Give them after the work of their hands. Render to them their deserts, their deserts. Because they regard not the works of the Lord, nor the operation of his hands, he shall destroy them and not build them up. Blessed be the Lord, because he hath heard the voice of my supplication. The Lord is my strength and my shield. My heart trusts in him, and I am helped. Therefore my heart greatly rejoices, and with my song will I praise him. The Lord is their strength, and he is the saving strength of his anointed. Save the people, and bless thine inheritance. Feed them also, and lift them up forever. Psalm 29 Give unto the Lord, O ye mighty, give unto the Lord glory and strength. Give unto the Lord the glory due unto his name. Worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. The voice of the Lord is upon the waters. The God of glory thundereth. The Lord is upon many waters. The voice of the Lord is powerful. The voice of the Lord is full of majesty. The voice of the Lord breaketh the cedars. Yea, the Lord breaketh the cedars of Lebanon. He maketh them also to skip like a calf, Lebanon and Sarion, like a young unicorn. The voice of the Lord di divideth the flames of fire. The voice of the Lord shaketh the wilderness. The Lord shaketh the wilderness of Kadesh. The voice of the Lord maketh the hinds to calve, and discover the forest in his temple. Doth every one speak of his glory? The Lord sitteth upon the flood, yea, the Lord sitteth king forever. The Lord will give strength unto his people. The Lord will bless his people with peace. Psalms 30 I will extol thee, O Lord, for thou hast lifted me up and hast not made my foes to rejoice over me. O Lord my God, I cried unto thee, and thou hast healed me. O Lord, thou hast brought my soul from the grave, thou hast kept me alive that I might not go down to the pit. Sing unto the Lord, O ye saints of his, and give thanks at the remembrance of his holiness. Okay, we're going to finish this. For his anger endureth but a moment, in his favor is life. Weeping may endure for a night, but joy cometh in the morning. And in my prosperity I said, I shall never be moved. Lord, by thy favor thou hast made my mountain to stand strong. Thou didst hide thy face, and I was troubled. I cried to thee, O Lord, and unto the Lord I made supplication. What profit is there in my blood when I go down to the pit? Shall the dust praise thee? Shall it declare thy truth? Hear, O Lord, and have mercy upon me, Lord. Be thou my helper. Thou hast turned for me my mourning into dancing. Thou hast put off sackcloth and girded me with gladness to the end that my glory may sing praise to thee and not be silent. O Lord, my God, I will give thanks unto thee forever. May the Lord add a blessing to you, the hearer and me, the reader of this precious and sacred always word of God. If you are blessed by these readings and you want to give a financial donation, you can go to www.7minutereread.com, www.7minutereread.com. There you will find a safe donation button. And also on that page, you'll have a little gift. My song, Encourage Yourself. That's my million dollar song, y'all. Y'all keep on listening, keep on watching and see. <laughs> Praise God. I am Mama Pam and I love you. Until the next read, continue to pray for me as I also pray with and for you.